If there's one thing that men and women in this country can agree on, it's our love of hockey and hockey players. And today you are in luck because I am with Matt Fratton and Jake Gardner here from the Toronto Maple Leafs to help me answer your questions. They know the drill. Puck bunnies, take notes. Here we go. Dear Wilder, my boyfriend is really into fitness and spends most of his time at the gym, but lately he is there every day. How can I get him to spend more time with me? That's a good question. What do you think? Guys need their guy time and... Uh... He's not gonna want to spend any more time with you if you're gonna kick him out of the gym. Take care of his body, she should be happy. Yeah. Okay. It is a really good excuse to get away from your girl. Maybe he's not at the gym all the time. <laughs> Hate to say it, but a guy that changes his schedule that quick out of out of nowhere. Right, he might at not actually be at the gym. Now we're putting weird things in her head. I, <laughs> <laughs> Just mine. Hey, she's gonna be like following him like <laughs> in the car in the pouring rain. Okay, I think we answered something there for you. Uh, we'll get to our next question. Dear Wilder, my boyfriend is a professional athlete and gets a lot of attention from other women. They post things on his website, Twitter, Facebook. He likes the attention, but it makes me uncomfortable. What do I do? I've known people like delete their Facebook, delete Twitter for kind of getting in fights over with their girlfriend over stuff like that, which is the social networking and how it is today. For myself, I don't mind it. I don't have a girlfriend, <laughs> so yeah, it comes and goes. Obviously, people are going to say things sometimes, right. and, and, and girls are going to maybe be crazy, but trust him, and uh, that's one of the biggest things in relationships. Trust, so I mean, for yeah. sure. When it comes to intense women, though, is, is, is that attractive? Kind of putting out a strong vibe like that to start off. It's definitely not one you want to take home to mom. <laughs> we got one more question. Dear Wilder, I had a one night stand with a really great guy and I feel like we connected and now I want more. I'd love to date him. How can I? Can she? Is this possible, guys? Yeah, I think it's possible. Yeah. I think it's more the guy has to go after the girl after that. I don't think the girl should be trying to chase the guy after a one night stand. In most cases, I'd probably say do not date the girl. It really, it all depends on how good that one night was. That's, 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 all, that's all there is to it. You know what, if she makes a good first impression, and or like you said, if it was that good, then... Uh... <laughs> Wait for the guy to get in touch with you because, yeah, it could seem a little too pushy. Just, just a stage five. And right, he's gonna stay yeah, turn away I think you're a stage five clearer. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for answering these right. questions. I think we gave some answers there that, uh, that they can use, hopefully. Or right back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>